On September 16th, the fighting pride of Rochester, USA, gets his second crack at a world title when ultra slick Willie Monroe Jr. faces WBO middleweight champion Billy Joe Saunders in a fight many feel could go either way. Willie uh, fought uh, Triple G and for two rounds gave him a very life or death. Cracked him pretty good. So he has been here before. Saunders is a good fighter, but he hasn't been at, at that level. And he comes from a family of fighters. His father, who I promoted 30 years ago when I was a younger man, his great uncle, Willie the Warren, was one of the best in his era. And so he, he knows what he's got to do. This is an opportunity for him to win the middleweight championship of the world. I lost to Golov, who was, who was at the top of the division, and they shot me to the bottom. And I got two solid wins and now I'm back at the top of the division. And the one title that I'm getting ready to fight for is the one title that's not tied up by Canelo and Golov. This is almost like, you know, fairy tale. you know what I mean? Like, shot me to the bottom of the barrel, and the one thing that they need, I'm about to have my hands on. So either Golovkin or Canelo will have to see me. Who do I think is gonna win? Canelo. Who do I want to win? I want my rematch with Triple G. Personally, I think Canelo is the better fighter, the more skilled fighter. Um, obviously, Canelo is a puncher, but you know, what's power to a missing target? Don't expect Monroe to be put off by either the brash, abrasive Saunders or the hostile environment that awaits him at London's Copper Box Arena. When you get in that ring, there's only me and you, you and Glofkin, and you said, I'm done. So you are a mentally weak person. If that's what it takes, if he has to get himself mentally psyched up by saying, oh, you quit against Golovkin and you know you have no heart and, and you're mentally weak, okay. Whatever it takes to get him in the ring on September 16th, if that's what it takes to build your confidence to sign that contract, by all means, say what you want to say. You know, the only reason why he's undefeated is because he's never left this country and they've been paying to bring guys in that he can beat. I'm the superior thinker, I'm the superior athlete. You know, I'm superior in, in every way to this guy. I might feel like boxing his ears off. I might feel like taking him out. You know, we'll see what happens when he takes the first punch. You know, if he's still there, then I'm gonna put numbers on him. If he's not, then short night. But come September 16th, when that bell ring, can't nobody save you. You'll be locked in that ring with a monster.